derby gets tense. Only four teams remain in the biggest club competition in the world, and we're not far away from kickoff in the first leg. It is Porto. They face Arsenal live right here on EA TV. And good evening on what is a perfect night for football. The floodlights shining down on the players as we speak. My name is Derek Ray and sitting alongside me, ready to provide all the analysis, is Stuart Robson. And on the menu, action from Europe's Premier Club competition, the Champions League. This the first leg of the semi-final. It's Porto versus Arsenal. Well, Derek, they don't come much bigger than this, do they? This will be a top quality game between two of the best sides in Europe. Let's hope it lives up to its billing. The initial 11 today for the hosts. Well, it's not fashionable, but 4-4-2 can still be a good system, both with and without the ball. Key to success today will be the wide players. They need to be the main creators. And a look at the starting lineup for Arsenal. Martin Odegaard plays alongside Declan Rice in central midfield. And the main forward is Gabriel Jesus. Spot on with that challenge. And just failed to keep the ball in play that time. Good high press. White. And here's Saliba. Jesus looking for the final pass that will open things up Wendell Galeno the attacking options appear plentiful. And making sure there was no danger in the end. And Varela with it. Well, we can give them high marks for their passing, but can they make this pressure count? importance of that tackle cannot be overstated Ben White Arsenal pushing forward with options available Arsenal a bit wasteful in possession. Eva Nilsson. Rice with it. Jesus. Martin Odegaard. Moving forward effectively. Throw in here for Arsenal. Chance to cross. Must take the lead here. And able to get a body in the way. And so it is, the first half story has been written.
And so the second half gets underway. Almost a case of the two teams saying to each other, whatever you can do, I can do just as well. And possibilities inside the box. And Kai Havertz... Spot on with that tackle. Galeno. Steven Eustachio. Excellent defending. And it's Gabriel Jesus, cuts it back. And teammates to play it to. Well, nothing to split the two sides, but this move looks promising. Well, he knew he had to get to the ball, and he did. And into the last 30 minutes now. Varela. Pepe. On to Taremi. Eva Nilsson. Very quick thinking there. Alexander Zinchenko. On to Jesus. And Gabriel Jesus, he's in behind. Well, they love him, and Arteta loves them. It's great scenes here. Well, let's look at this again. To pick out this pass shows wonderful vision. It's inch perfect. And what a clinical finish this is from Jesus. He hits it with such power. That's a good goal. Well, all eyes are on the manager. What's he going to do to turn this around? Back underway, and 1-0 it is. Let's see what happens next. Fabio Cardoso. The ball with Pepe. 20 minutes to go in this one. Pepe. Pepe. The ball with Pepe. Mario Varela went in strongly, decisively. Gabriel Martinelli now Zinchenko Kai Havertz. It's with Gabriel Alexander Zinchenko. Kai Havertz. Well, I think the fans are doing everything they can to get their team back into this. But can they find that moment of inspiration and get an equaliser? Havertz. Gabriel Martinelli. Crossing opportunity. Well, they'll be looking to add to their advantage from this corner. Well, both teams have had substitutes swarming up, and now both will rely on their respective benches. Playing it in. Well, they weren't able to capitalize. Rice. Defensive Brazilians to shut them down. Pepe. The referee has decided there will be just one minute of added time. 
Oh, that's fine defensive play. The final whistle, the first leg is over, and Arsenal currently in control of the tie. They carry a lead into the second match. Well, at this stage of the tournament, you'd take any lead going into that second leg. I tell you what, though, this tie is far from over. Very little to split between the two sides, and it's set up perfectly for round two. Well, as you can see, our cameras remain affixed to Gabriel Jesus. Another fantastic day at the office for him, Stuart. Well, he gave them a really hard time, didn't he? His speed of thought was excellent, and he took the winning goal so well. He was brilliant today.